Welcome, Aries. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. All right, Aries. All right. So I see um, good news on Tuesday in this week for some of you. It doesn't have to be Tuesday. I see um, that you uh, stand strong over a situation with a friend or um, with your sister or brother. A whole lot of communication is going to be coming out. A lot of you Aries was not aware of some sort of a problematic situation um, that a Cancer was going through and a Pisces, a Pisces and a Cancer. Now, if you have sisters and brother that is Pisces and Cancers, a whole lot of information is going to be coming out about this person. Cancers, Pisces and Scorpion. Regrets for a Scorpion family. Our end is coming up for a Scorpion family. They know, recognize what a Scorpion family have done. Um, the Scorpion family has co-created some sort of a, um, deceptiveness and has uh, created a whole lot of interference in some sort of a problematic situation. Emotions. A lot of you are having relationship problems in this week. Uh, but you will overcome this problematic situation. A lot of you are dealing with the Pisces and the Scorpion and the Cancer. These are your sisters and brothers, and they created a whole lot of interference. You're standing strong in this week, Aries. So whatever is happening between you and your partner, I see that you, Aries, are going to be reconnecting with your partner. There was some sort of a relationship problems that was going on. It is a very emotional week, Aries. I can tell you that. And it has to do with family issues, okay, and interference. And their a corporation institution is going to be recognizing that there was some sort of an interference with a child or data of a child. I see that a lot of you were hoping for some sort of a news from a family. Um, and uh, um, whoever the Pisces man is, uh, I see problems for a Pisces man. A cycle is over for a Pisces man and its family. The Pisces man did something that was not above water. Um, here we see the rod of uh, the, the wheel of fortune and the world Aries, and this is going to be good. Some sort of a problematic situation that you Aries had with a Pisces man, I see. You are going to be winning this situation. Some of you, if the Pisces man was your husband or um, it is a Pisces cancer or scorpion man that you Aries had some sort of a problem with, I see you're going to be winning. Some sort of a communication is coming at a family. This is like heavy, heavy communication. Um, and I see that an Aquarian, Gemini or Libran is um, really coming in with a lot of communication against you, Aries men. I see that a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person is protected um, from a situation that is going on. Um, here we see the energy of uh, so your friends. So um, whatever is happening and transpiring, Aries. Uh, um, friends, I see an end to some sort of an influence. You, Aries, was trying to influence uh, a situation to go in your direction, but it's not. Uh, an end for a um, <clears throat> some sort of a communication and data that came out. They're now recognizing what has transpired. So let's look at the family. So if you, Aries, uh, your father or your husband is a Pisces, some sort of a problems. Um, for your your father or your husband that is a Pisces. If your child father is a Pisces, some sort of a problematic situation and you Aries are protecting yourself from this. Uh, good news is going to be coming in on um, Tuesday. Um, they are now um, resolving um, some sort of a problematic situation that was transpiring is going to be coming to an end. I see the Wheel of Fortune is ending some sort of a conflict. So, that a lot of you Aries was having with a Pisces Cancer Scorpion man. It is now going to be coming to an end. I see um, um, friends from the past is going to be returning for a lot of you Aries. So when we look at the work and home situation, I see communication is coming in and I see the law is coming down on you Aries. It can be a project or some sort of a 
um, work situation I see an Aquarian Gemini or Libra person is really um, coming down on you Aries and your business or Aries with some sort of a situation contractual agreement with a house that sort of a thing um, Aries that co-created some sort of a um, chaos um, for a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person now the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is coming up and whatever is happening you Aries wanted some sort of a contractual agreement, but um, this person is not uh, interested anymore in moving forward. And I see um, you are um, going to be trying to reconnect with this person. Maybe it's a sister, maybe it's an older sister or older family mem member. But this person decided to, you know, not move forward with you, Aries, whatever the, the situation is, this person has decided, um, okay, since as you have left so many times, I'm not going to be reconsidering you to return a second time because, you know, it's always going and coming, going and coming. A whole lot of regretful situation and you, Aries, are really regretting um, what you have done. It's as if you, Aries, uh, did something um against a Taurus Virgo or a Capcom person and now is regretting because you're recognizing that um whoever this person is could have been a big sister or a aunt or something like that or your mother and you're recognizing that uh, you know you should whatever you have done you shouldn't have done it I'm seeing that this is like for some of you is a far cousin some of you is a cousin okay so I see an older Aquarian Gemini or Libra person is going to really speak up and really um, let people know what was happening in a corporation institution. And I see um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capcom person is really um, telling the truth of what has transpired in the past. So, and it's ending some sort of a cycle and and communicating because i see some sort of a problematic situation for a child in the family so if you are married to an aquarian gemini or libra and your mother is an aquarian gemini or libra aries your mother and you are in some sort of a problem data and information came out and is going to be shutting down um your business is really going to be shutting down a business that some of you Aries are running, okay? Um, and Gemini woman is regretting ever connected with you Aries, whatever that has transpired. I see this Gemini woman is really regretting um, that they have collaborated with you Aries. So, so um, Jupiter is in Gemini and a Gemini is going to be speaking up about what you Aries have done and this Gemini is going to be ending um, some sort of a um, relationship contractual agreement that they had with you so it's as if you Aries went back to a Gemini for some sort of a help and the Gemini recognized that um, you know you have been coming and you have been coming and coming for help and it's about time you stand on your own so um if your parents are gemini you and a, a gemini if your parents if your mother is a gemini your mother is an aquarian you and your mother is in some serious serious problem aries okay so um when we look at the situation um problematic situation with friends from the past is coming to an end a lot of you were having uh, relationship problems with cousin that was scorpion and cancer. This is coming to an end. A scorpion wants to return and have some sort of a con connection with you, Aries. But you, Aries, are like kind of thinking, why? Why does scorpion wants to return? So whatever is going on is that... Uh, you will be happy to hear from this person, but you are not, uh, you do not want to go in any close relationship with this person. Okay, so it could be out of the blues you get a text um, from a scorpion. Okay, and um, you're like, okay, all right, let 
me let your mother know um and it is a situation where i see a scorpion and a lot of you aries who have a scorpion child yours your child is connected with some sort of a, a friendships or or relations that is not based on a reality okay that these people are not good um for this child to be in any relationship with so be aware of this aries okay I see that a Taurus Virgo coming, a Taurus Virgo, a Capricorn woman, and a Pisces person stand very strong. And I see they're going to be protecting this couple from you, Aries. It's as if they're not recognizing that you, Aries, have some sort of a hate towards a couple, a Pisces and a Taurus Virgo, a Capricorn person. It's as if you, Aries, have a hate towards this person. And they're not going to be protecting the, this person, these people, from you, Aries, okay? A Pisces, um, yeah. And they're going to be seeing that, because uh, they're going to be tracking back and recognize that with conversation and communication, you, Aries, had really a huge aid towards uh, a um, Pisces and a Taurus Virgo a Capricorn couple. Eight and jealousy. That is what they're recognizing now. Good news is going to be coming up, but this good news is for a Pisces man. Whoever the Pisces man is and whatever is happening, they're now recognizing. Good news for the Pisces man because the Pisces man is now um, going to be um, recognizing that a Taurus Virgo a Capricorn person was the correct person and this person is now wanting to go back and apologize to this person. But I see that this lady has turned her back on this person. So it is a situation where I see an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person is going to be resolving a situation and try to protect um, a couple from something that you Aries has done. We see the night of uh, um, once is coming at you Aries with sharp communication. Whatever is happening between you Aries and a, and a, and a Aquarian Gemini or Libran, because it's as if the law I've caught this Aquarian Gemini or Libran, and I see this Aquarian Gemini and Libran is coming up to you Aries and said, "You Aries was the one who gave me this advice and told me to do this, and now I'm in problem." So I see. A young um, Aries Leo or Sagittarian person is coming after you, Aries, because they have been called to, um, for a situation. They're now going to be recognized that um, you, Aries, was lying and that a, a house or a property is belong to a Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran, and a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person. I see the law is going to be choosing um, to protect this Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person because they now recognize the devastated situation that you Aries have created for this woman and her child and this woman, her husband, this woman and her partner. They're now recognizing. They're now recognizing that, that the stories where we're Capcom person do not have any sisters and brothers. They're now recognizing that this lady have one child that is a scorpion. They're now recognizing that you Aries have uh, um, broke in this lady house and have acquired this lady um dead parents documentation and uh, um this pair this woman child data and information and was passing it off as it is your um your your grandchild and they now recognize that you have not been speaking the truth so now a lot of regrets for you Aries because I see um, that a Aquarian Gemini or Libra is going to be speaking up and is going to be saying, um, no, uh, you are no family to the Taurus Virgo Capricorn person. Um, you created this illusionary story and now you have brought me in a family. And they, you know, whoever this Aquarian Gemini or Libra person is going to say, no, um, that's not your grandchild. That is not true. Um, you know, the Taurus Virgo Capricorn person, um, is, um, a, a good friend of mine or was a good friend of mine. And the Scorpion person is their child. So I see an Aquarian Gemini or Libra is going to be recognizing our 
you Aries have formulated some sort of a conflict in situation and have gotten them in some serious, serious problem. I see um, falling out of uh, 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 cousins uh, or happening. And uh, I see that a lot of people, you have a hung up against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, whatever your hung up is. And, you know, this, this, this family member is like, I separate myself from you people. I don't care what you people have to say about me. You know, I'm staying on the right and narrow part. You people, um, you know, however you look at me and whatever your opinion about me, that's your problem. Okay. But, you know, I am releasing myself of this negative energy and frequency. So a lot of you Aries, you know, you recognize that, uh, um, you can't have this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person in your pocket. Um, they're not like that. They, they are going to speak the truth. So I see that, um, your sister could have just, um, your older sister that's the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is protecting another um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person because she recognized that you Aries have done something with another cousin against this person. So a whole lot of information is going to be coming out and they're going to be seeing um, that you older Aries women have two face and uh, it's a situation that your older sister that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person is going to be speaking to you about what you have done to your cousin. So, you know, it's as if this older Taurus of Virgo or Capricorn person recognize um, the, and this person is your sister, is going to be recognizing that instead of you protect um, a cousin, you formulated and collaborate with a scorpion cousin and create a lot of chaos. And I see that your older sister that is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn is going to speak to you, Aries, about what you have done because the older sister recognize why another relative turned their back on the family it's because of you and what you and a scorpion cousin have done a lot of you who have scorpion kids your kids is in um um problems because of the friends that they hung out with and i see um that you women who have a scorpion um uh, you areas that have a scorpion um kid let the kid get married and this kid wants out of the marriage now and it's a situation where you Aries women because you like the um the child's mother your grandchild's mother you wanted your son or daughter to get married to this person you created this marriage and now this person is not happy in the marriage and i see that this person wants to end the marriage and you're not happy because this person, you wanted this person to stay with the child's mother. But again, parents, we don't decide who our children go with. We, we, that is not, we can't push a child to get married to someone. That is not your, that, that is not your position. That is not where you should be at. That is not something that you need to do. And this is what you Aries did. And I see that your husband, your son or daughter, is really um, upset now because they want to end the marriage and they think that too much influence is there. All right. Um, so a corporation institution is going to be finding out a lot of stuff and is going to be ending some sort of a uh, interference that uh, you Aries at a whole lot of interference and, um, against the Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. You were creating a lot of interference for the Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn woman. And I see that they are going to be ending this. I gotta go. I do love you guys. Namaste. Mm -hmm.